Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, good morning. And hopefully today's gonna be a pretty good day when it comes to PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X restocks. It is now officially the start of the week again, so we can kind of get back in the good old grind and keep on trying our best to go and find some really good places to get some restocks going on. As well, guys, we also have some pretty good rumors, a few little kind of confirmations, and a lot of things we've been saying all throughout these past few days or so, a little bit of extra bonus information as well thrown on in. And I always do want to remind you guys, make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on. We usually do do our nice weekly video, which is usually a little bit better than the at least the Monday daily video. Monday, we usually get a lot of rumors and a lot of information, and sometimes we get some good drops, don't get me wrong. I think a lot of us is usually throughout the whole week. So make sure you guys are for sure going to check out that video in a few hours. And I'll probably go a lot more in depth on like percentages of which drops are going to happen, which places I think are going to be happening based on trends and all that stuff as well. So make sure you guys are aware. And on top of that in general, and on top of that too, we also did announce another brand new PS5 giveaway going on as kind of the same rules as the previous one. All you guys have to go do is be subscribed to be entered in to go and win in the first place. So Amazon links down below for the PS5 disc, digital console controller, Twitter and Twitch room down below if you guys want to follow, Weeble, sign up for Weeble, deposit $100, you guys go get free stack and free money, Coinbase, you guys go buy $100 worth of any cryptocurrency, you guys go and get free Bitcoin, those are always linked down below, like the video if you guys would like to, let's go dive in the video itself. So, let's go cover up, uh, we, I'm sure you guys know, I'll maybe do a really quick recap on all the walk-ins, Myers has been having a lot of PlayStation 5 walk-ins, even as of yesterday, we've still been seeing people confirming and getting their consoles, the PlayStation 5 consoles, the Xbox Series X consoles, and all of that, we've been seeing little bits of rumors, very smaller amounts of rumors on the Xbox Series Xs. We've only maybe seen one so far, so it's not like a really crazy big rumor. PlayStations, we've been seeing people getting them. We've been people confirming employees getting them. We've been getting everything throughout these past four days or so. Probably still worth checking, especially for Mondays. They sometimes may just have leftover stock from the weekend floating around. But don't forget, this is maybe like day three or four of it. So it gets a little bit more on the lower end. We'll probably somewhat expect that. But we also have a lot just based on the previous Myers restocks. Wednesdays and Thursdays and Saturdays and two Sundays are usually where we've seen a lot of employees confirm that stock arrives, that there is stock there or whatever. So be on the lookout when it comes to Myers for stock floating around for that throughout this whole upcoming week, but especially for today and maybe tomorrow. I'll probably keep on mentioning that in the daily videos for all that news. Same thing with the Xbox Series S's. We actually have been seeing a few other walk-in rumors when it comes to Walmart. Walmart actually apparently has been getting a few more Xbox Series S consoles in stores, as well as also Myers. On top of that, have also been so, like we've been seeing people reporting that there are some Xbox Series S consoles in stores and available and all of that good stuff. So just be on the lookout for all of that. And as well, we also did go and cover up some more BJ stuff. BJ's has had some Xbox Series X's kind of floating in and out. We've definitely seen a lot more percentage, like the likelihood of the percentage on Myers. So you guys don't have to waste your gas and all of that. But Myers themselves has been looking a lot more successful, a lot more better. Stock employees, as I just kind of mentioned, blah, 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 blah. So just letting you guys know if you guys want to check, if you guys have checked their stores throughout this weekend, feel free to leave a comment down below. And then overall, it should be, I think, pretty good. And maybe we'll have some more restocks all throughout Myers throughout this week. It might have actually been a pretty good restock wave too, because we saw a lot of confirmations, a lot of people talking about it, a lot of people getting it, and just overall good. As well, I did want to touch on the Target stuff. We did make a video on it yesterday, but it does kind of seem like Target overall might still have some bonus consoles. We touched on this before, but Target, when they have leftover additional stock from the drops, like someone doesn't pick up the drop, the credit card doesn't go through, debit card, the bank's holding money, all of that shit basically means that it has a chance for you guys to go talk to employees and they might have additional stock. We did see a few uh, stories of people saying that there was physical like PS5 consoles on the shelves in the gaming sections. I'm sure you guys know what I mean for Target. So be on the lookout for that or more so maybe ask employees. But don't forget, this is only available for allocated bonus additional stock that was set for the actual restock, like actually was set for the for like the drop that was on Thursday or Friday. So as long as you guys know that it's probably going to be unlikely, probably not going to be that much additional stock and all that, but at least we are seeing a little bits and pieces of rumors floating around. We may also be seeing this throughout the next few days too as well. So just keep that in mind. And as like I said too as well, maybe a little bit of BJ's. And also we did also see the military. It was a lot of walking stuff. A lot of the military uh, raffles going on. If you guys are in Navy bases or exchanges or whatever, be on the lookout for it. So we actually have been seeing a lot of people confirming, getting stock, and or more so having their chance to go get either the PlayStation 5 or Xbox consoles. A lot of walking stuff. I'll probably mention all that throughout these morning videos. Just be aware on that. So now let's go talk about some other stuff that you guys may not have actually heard about. So we are on the start of the week. So once again, we're going to be on the lookout for the Ant Online. I'd probably say the likelihood of a PS5, unless they come in extremely clutch, in like, I'm talking crazy clutch, 
probably will not happen for the PS5 this week. We can see though, but Xbox is we're going to kind of probably start watching our restock and re watching of them as well. Uh, Costco has not dropped in quite some time for both the Xbox Series X and PlayStation 5 bundles. So some of you guys know that's going to be a little bit more of a likelihood. And we usually do see that a little bit more in the earlier days of the week. Usually Anton line, I feel like a lot of like Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursdays. And also on Mondays too, we've definitely seen Monday drops if they ever plan on doing like a double drop. So like they do like one restock wave and then another one. And then Costco, I usually do see more earlier in the week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I mean, we've seen on every day, but that's usually the trend I see. And then same things too as well with Sam's Club. That's a little bit more on the overdue side in general. So let you guys know on that for both the PlayStation 5 bundles and Xbox bundles. Uh, we did not go and see any of the, uh, what's it called? We have not just seen like in the PlayStation Direct emails as of today. So just be on the lookout for that. But I do want to put a really big focus on GameStop. We did go and see some actual, like um, a little bit of rumors on this for some emails floating around that GameStop actually went and sent out emails. So I do want to go give that notion on that. I, do, I will probably maybe go touch on this in the weekly video in case it does not do any drops or whatever on that one. So I'll let you guys know, but GameStop, I think, might have actually been sending out emails and comments and stuff like that. So I'll let you guys know if we see any more or if there's going to be a restock. If GameStop does do a restock on both either the PS5 or Xboxes, they've been kind of switching on up, sometimes more like the 10, 10, 30 o'clock range or so. So maybe like three, four hours from now. But as well, we have also done a little bit more on like the 2 to 3 p.m. ranges or so as well. So as long as you guys know, there is a small chance. I don't want to hype you guys up too, too much, but at least we have been seeing some social media stuff. And usually whenever they try to go promote out the like $15, like get your early access console, $5, whatever it is type thing, uh, they actually have done drops. So I'm not, I'm not going to say it's 100% today, but at least we do know that GameStop is going to be alive. So be on the lookout all throughout the rest of the day or so. I'll probably be a little bit busy for work too. So in case I miss it on Twitter or whatever, don't mind me on that as well for some other drops. As I mentioned, Target, unless you guys care about the walk-ins, probably nothing crazy, but they have keep on doing those Xbox Series X bundles. Or not bundles, just Xboxes in general. So check your local area, check your zip code, check the online stuff. We have been seeing a lot more of that. Walmart, we have done seen those really weird late night restocks, but I kind of doubt it. So if it happens, it'll be really YOLO. Amazon, I'm going to try my best to see if we get any good Amazon restock rumors floating around. Uh, just like more if any stock arrives or any stuff like that, I will 100% let you guys know ASAP. But as well, you guys can always keep on checking the links down below for the Amazon warehouses because we keep on seeing a lot of Xbox Series X warehouses and PS5 warehouses every now and then. So I'll let you guys know if we see any more stock arrive and all that good stuff. On top of that, too, Best Buy. We are going to be probably watching Best Buy throughout this week. I was, uh, I wouldn't surprise me that much if we maybe don't see too much Best Buy movement this week and more so next week. I'll touch on that more on the weekly video, so make sure you guys watch that. But Best Buy itself could happen. We actually have seen Best Buy do Monday movement for the GPUs, uh, Xboxes, and PS5s. So just be aware you possibly can. We also have seen Walmart also do individual Xbox restocks as well. So as you guys know, in general, there's always always a possibility. But I do think GameStop or Best Buy will be some bigger, big hyper focuses. And then also Costco too as well. And some other little side things too. Don't always forget about the new egg shuffle. We did go and see them go and cover up the uh, consoles late last week. So it might be a little bit more on the chiller side this week, uh, just in general. So maybe a little bit more like maybe Wednesday onwards and such. Like I said, no PS Direx earlier on. And all the big boys might be a little bit quiet. Usually Mondays are a really big rumor, building up information type day. So just keep yourselves up in the date for that. And besides the military websites, we maybe see some stuff with that too. But when it comes to all these side additional retailers, we're also going to be still waiting for Gamefly because they did go do some teasing and they did go do an Xbox Series X bundle restock not that long ago. So it'd probably make a lot of sense to you if the PS5 also has some additional leftover stock floating around, which I'm kind of hyped up for and I think it'll turn out pretty, pretty good. Uh, whenever they do actually have a proper drop and usually game flies up for a pretty long time. So I always give them a pretty good thumbs up for that. We also might have a few of those little smaller res uh, restocks floating around or even like the Microsoft Directs too, if you guys have kind of been seeing those floating around a lot throughout this week. But overall, we usually do see Mondays be a little bit more on the quarter side. But with the 4th of July week already being done, maybe this might be all a little bit more all over the place and maybe a little bit more active on these days because a lot of these places might be overdue on stock and we might have a good chance to, well, of course, get additional things. So we'll kind of go and see if I see more additional stuff or rumors. I'll 100% make some videos on the channel itself, let you guys know, keep you guys in the loop. As well, I just appreciate you guys all so much just for watching and hanging out and chilling. Make sure you guys are subscribed, especially for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway. We as well also will be uh, 
I'm just kind of just doing a bunch of videos upon the notifications. Amazon links down below for the PS5 disc, digital controllers, consoles, all of that. Twitter and Twitch stream if you guys would like to follow up on either or. And of course, the Weeble. Sign up for Weeble. Deposit $100. You guys go get free stack and free money. Coinbase, you guys go buy $100 worth of any cryptocurrency. You guys go and get free Bitcoin. Those are always linked down below. And uh, just thank you guys all so much for watching. Hopefully, we'll, I'll give you guys good reports if we see more good stuff as well. All throughout today and the rest of this week. But be on the lookout for our video in a few hours. Love you guys.